Hey guys, it's Chris from Steeda, and next to me you'll see our 2018 Mustang drag car, dubbed the Silver Bullet. As many of you may know, this is Scott's baby. He's really worked hard to make this the fastest 2018 Mustang naturally aspirated car in the world. And he's out of the office right now, which means we'll be able to throw on a set of Morimoto XB LED headlights and see his reaction at the end. All right, so time is of the essence. We're gonna get in the showroom, give you a full product review of these Morimoto headlights. Then after that, we'll take the car around back, get them installed, really change up the look of the front end of the S550, and ultimately get Scott's reaction. These Morimoto XB LED headlights will fit your 2018 to current Mustang. Now the OEM headlights look great, but if you're looking to make your Mustang stand apart from the rest, then these XB headlights will do just the trick. One thing that makes these XB LED headlights stand apart from the rest is the daytime running light. You can see that it actually runs all the way around the edge, really making these headlights give a much more aggressive look to the front end of your S550. Additionally, these headlights retain the tri-bar daytime running lights that you see on the OEM headlights, which is very reminiscent of the first generation Mustangs as well. At night, you'll notice the main difference over the OEM headlights is that these Morimotos feature a triple LED bulb setup that not only maximizes light output, but also features a color temperature of 5500K, which gives you that ultra bright white light. They feature a UV resistant polycarbonate lens that'll fight against those UV rays over the years and an IP67 waterproof rating, and when aligned correctly, they are DOT and SAE approved. But perhaps my favorite part about these headlights is that they are completely plug and play, as you're about to see in the install. Really shouldn't be too bad of an install considering the factory headlights for the 2018 Plus Mustangs are already LED from the factory, so don't need to worry about conversion harnesses or anything like that. So it should be completely plug and play, pull the bumper off, pop the headlights in, bumper goes back on and you're done. So let's get to it. All right, so we're in the shop. Let's kick off this installation. First thing we need to do is unplug the negative battery terminal. So once you have the negative battery terminal unplugged, you'll want to grab your panel removal tool and begin removing the radiator cover. Now keep in mind, as we move through this installation, there are a few things about the Silver Bullet that are different from a factory 2018 Mustang GT, but overall the installation should be pretty close. And once you finish pulling all the push pins out, you're ready to get your radiator cover off. So then you want to grab your ratchet, a 5.5 millimeter socket, and a 5 16 socket to begin pulling the bolts holding the bumper cover to the car. The ones on either end are the smaller five and a half millimeter ones. Grab your panel removal tool and then you'll be able to get these plastic push pins out so you can pull the plastic wheel well back so you can get to the bumper bracket here, unbolt it so you can pull it away from the car. Now ignore this gaping hole here. Your car probably doesn't have that. It's because things are rubbing a little bit here. But thankfully we got the wheel and tire combination with built specialties all figured out. Then you're gonna peel the fender back, hold it back with one hand, grab your 10 millimeter socket and loosen up these brackets here. And then once you have the nuts off, you're ready to pull this bracket through. Super ingenious design, much better than the 15 to 17 cars, which use the tabs. Love how they did it with the 18s, keeping this bumper attached to the fender. And then once you're done with this side, you'll move over to the other side and do the same thing. Now we're gonna lift it up a little bit higher and grab the bottom. So as you can see, there are a fair amount of modifications done in the silver bullet when it comes to the underside, including the K-member. So there might be a couple of things that are different here than your average uh, 2018 Mustang. But in our particular case, we're just gonna go ahead and unsnip these zip ties. You may have some bolts and push pins to take care of on the backside here, but realistically, you should be able to take the belly pan and the bumper cover off as one unit from the front if you go ahead and remove anything on the backside here to get it away from the factory K member.
Now you're ready to pull the bumper cover off. Next up, you're ready to remove the headlight, grab a 10 millimeter socket and get to work. Thirteen millimeter. Once you have the headlight free, obviously there's going to be a connection around back. First, you want to unplug the harness back here which is super easy for these cars as it's just one harness. You push the top there and pull out. Next, you'll wanna grab a panel removal tool and pull it away from the headlight. Just clicks into place. And your headlight's free. You see this clip on the back side of the top mount for the headlight? You wanna pull it off. and transfer it over to the new headlight. You're gonna to wanna to grab your Morimoto headlight and the harness, go ahead and plug it in. Hear that confidence inspiring click. So as you pull the headlight up into place, there's two areas you're gonna to wanna to pay attention to. Right here, this hole lines up on either end here and on the side, this lines up with this notch right here. Once you have your first bolt in place, you should be able to let it go. Slowly line everything else up. Just get it started by hand. Shoulder bolt goes in the top. Doesn't hurt to get these things down by hand first before you wrench on them, potentially cross thread anything. At the end of the day, these things are plastic. All right, so we're gonna plug in the negative battery terminal real quick since we have everything off to go ahead and check and make sure everything works correctly. It's one plug, so I don't see why there would be a problem. And then we'll repeat the process on the other side, put everything back together, and your installation's complete. All right, got the headlight back in place, bumper cover back on. Installation really isn't that bad. Totally plug and play. I gotta plug Morimoto right here for the shipping. I mean, their packaging is absolutely next level. Absolutely love the way these things came out of the box and how they look on the car. I'm really excited to see Scott's reaction, so we'll show you a before and after, and then get Scott's reaction on the Morimoto XB LED headlights on his silver bullet. things what in the hard parking name of marketing is going on here oh. somebody really messed with the silver car so wow, uh they look what do you think what the heck did you guys do uh kind of may have wrenched on your car while you were out of the office it looks like it what do what? you think though When's the next car show? <laughs> I mean, they look pretty cool. I know all you like doing with this car is just hard parking and 
winning car show trophies. If you ask Glenn and some of the other people, we, we race for the shortest amount of time possible, and then we just try and look pretty the rest of the time, which is really hard. Well, but, uh, these are the uh, Morimoto XB LED headlights, okay. fitting 2018 plus Mustangs. Oh, we have a set you put on the 13, right? Yes. Okay. All right, I remember those. They look really cool. Now, you know the rules. It doesn't go on the car unless it makes it actually faster. So are we going to be a little faster with these things? Of course, of course. All right, all right. Well, it looks fast sitting still, right? Yeah, it's faster than anything sitting still. But uh, <laughs> hey, yeah, well, the car's been meant to stand out. And uh, I was promoting a product, especially for one of our good vendors. Hey, let's have at it. I mean, I know the competition won't be able to see them because they're on the front of the car and not the back. So uh, <laughs> maybe if I let them do the burnout first, they'll be able to see them. There you go, exactly. So, uh, but hey, they're, they're, they're cool looking. So hopefully Scott isn't too upset with me, but let's be honest, these Morimoto headlights look awesome on our Silver Bullet. And if you want to pick up a set for your 2018 Plus Mustang, be sure to head to Stita.com. If you like the content of this video, go ahead and hit that like button and subscribe for more awesome Mustang content on the CETA channel. And don't forget the most important thing, speed matters.